Time to slow things down and see what's happening in the 608 this morning. You have a couple of chances to give blood this week as the Red Cross is seeing a critical one cop car shortage. And all two Josh Breider is live in Platteville this morning Nisa. where there's a blood drive happening today in honor of my brother, Levi. Hi, Josh. Hey, Leah and Chris, good morning to you. Yeah, we have uh, kind of a twofer this morning. We have the blood drive in honor of Levi, but we also have a way to uh, really give back during a critical blood shortage right now. We're live here in Platteville this morning, and we've got uh, Greg Navinsko with the Red Cross with us, and this is kind of a critical time for you guys. Obviously, a very special blood drive today for us, but a time that you guys really, really are desperate need of blood. Yeah, we are, Josh. Thank you. And it's a special day for us, too. Um, being part of this has been... Um, great. Last year, we collected over 239 pints of blood between Platteville and Highland, which is probably close to double what they typically would do um, in honor of Levi. It's um, summertime. COVID's kind of winding down a little bit, so to speak, and folks are we're competing for their time, right? They've been cooped up for a year, looking to get folks to come out and still roll up their sleeves in honor of Levi and, and do good and feel good about doing the good. Yeah, yeah. So there are a couple of op opportunities this week uh, here in the Platteville area and then Highland on Friday. Talk a little bit about how people can give back right now. Well, they can go to redcrossblood.org and um, they can sign up for an appointment uh, online um, for either today in, in Platteville at the Bronski Center here from 11 to 5 or on um, Friday in Highland at... I always get the church, it's, I know it's two names, uh, Anthony Phillips Catholic Church, and um, they can sign up online there. Uh, they can download the blood donor app uh, at, the, at their store. And uh, that, that's, the nice thing about the blood donor app is that when you give blood, you can take your, do all your questions before you get here right online. And be, it's called Rapid Pass. You get in, get out a little quicker, uh, out and enjoy the nice weather we're having. And... Um, then you can follow your blood on this journey. So we take care of our local needs here first, but after uh, they can they can look at and see where their blood goes. So we take care of the you know the entire country as part of the American Red Cross as well. So this is the second annual Live Like Levi Blood Drive, and last year you said was very very special. <laughs> and I mean, uh, you know, this is a an event that you guys really really like to be able to put on in memory of obviously one of our own Levi Lynchide, yeah. but just to be able to get out into the community and get back as well. Yeah, it was. You know, what, what kind of prompted it for me personally was I had listened to Leah's story, uh, the letter from Levi, or letter to Levi, uh, a couple, year and a half ago or so, and um, just, it just touched my heart. And I'm like, you know, I really would like to see if we can do something with the Lynchides and keep Levi's memory alive while, you know, while he's not here with us. And um, they were so gracious to allow us to be part of this. It's been, it's been a great event. And... We, we are really happy to be part of it. Oh, yeah, we're happy to be here, too. So 11 to 5 here at the Broski Center in Platteville. Today, correct. All right. Well, thank you so much. Again, we'll be talking to uh, uh, Greg coming up here a little bit later on. And actually coming up in our next half hour, guys, we're going to be talking to uh, one of Levi's uh, friends a little bit more about why it's so important to give back and just a little bit more about uh, who Levi was to this community and why we are here to live like Levi, guys. Boy, if there was uh, ever a time to donate and to give blood, I mean, what more do you need? A couple of great reasons uh, to give this morning. Josh Breider, thanks a lot. Josh, thank you. Remember to let Josh know what inspires you in the 608. You can shoot him an email or reach out to him on social media for a chance to be featured.